Well, yeah, it was tense. It was uh, Waylon wanted uh, control, artistic control, and uh, RCA had studios, they had engineers. It had gone against the grain of everything that RCA had done. Chet sat behind his desk and we told him what we wanted. You know, it looked like they were gonna walk. At one point, uh, Chet said, is, is that your final request? And when we said yes, there was this long, long silence. They're that close to making a deal for me to sign back with RCA. Chet Atkins is over there, and I'm here. There's peanuts right there. And uh, I'm sitting there, and it's getting unbearably quiet, because whoever, whoever says something gives in. They lose. That's the way that goes. Everybody said what they wanted to say. It was like a game of chess. It must have gone on for a couple of minutes. Waylon, I could see, was getting anxious. After a while, I couldn't stand it no longer, and I said, what kind of peanuts are these, Chet? And Neil said, shut up. About a minute later, Chet said, if those are the terms that you need, and that's the only way to do it, I guess we'll have to give it to you. When we got outside, Waylon said, no one ever told me to shut up before. But it worked. Reshin's next step was to expose Whalen to a wider audience.